Okay, this is going to be the first moment of truth. So I just built a new loop and I have a sweet overclock going. It's, you know, 4.7, 4.6 gigahertz, depending on the CD. And this is what I just... Creatively mount two 480s right here. People were like, no, you can't do it. You can do anything with a Dremel and willpower. But no, you Okay, can't. yeah, that one just like inspired me. And of course there's a lot of other YouTubers that I owe some thanks to. Okay, this is what I have going on here. So I didn't do two 480s. I have a 480 here. I have, you know, really thick 360 here. And then for the top 360 up here, this is outside of the case. Well, I don't know. I'll have to upload a photo. Um, essentially, I just dremeled through the top of the case. And since this is just like the pro version instead of the Lux or whatever, there isn't any like extra plastic or anything on top. It's just like, you know, a metal sheet for the roof. So, you know, you cut a little hole in that and all of a sudden you have a ton of extra mounting space. So that's also a 60 millimeter thick 360 on the top. And yeah, the Optimus water block, I think Dot Poets was the person who sort of turned me on to their stuff. And it's just keeping this 5950X super, super cool. Um, I can actually, I can push the overclocks a little bit harder but I don't know I kind of liked this one for the temps and that's the new build